Hi everyone, this is Jessica Reimer here at the home office and I wanted to give you a quick tutorial about the Glisten Up Skin Stick. So this is a great highlighting skin stick and I wanted to show you kind of how I use it um, even though you can use it on bare skin or if you wear very minimal makeup. Clearly I do not, I love cosmetics so I will show you how I layer it with my favorite highlighter. So as you can tell, I've got my makeup on, I've got the foundation, I have my contour done, um, and I just don't have my highlighter or blush or lipstick on yet, so I'm just gonna kind of walk you through that. So first, what you're gonna wanna do, and this is how I do it, so you're, you can do it however you wanna do it. But I take the Glisten Up, and it has like a super creamy shea butter vanilla fragrance to it. And I just like to take a little bit on my finger and then I'll apply it to a few different points of my face. So first I apply it right here to my upper lip. Now I'm careful if you have not been waxed recently, you're going to want to get waxed if you want to pop and highlight on your lip. I also add it to the tip of my nose. And then I take a little bit and I spread it a little further along my finger. And I just apply it to my, the tops of my cheekbones here. Just kind of pat it in. And then I take my other finger and I do the same thing on the same side. I mean on the other side, so I just pat it in. So you can tell, I mean I wear a lot of foundation, but you can tell that it's already creating a glow just on top of my foundation and that might be enough for you. Clearly it's not enough for me. I like to really go in and have my highlight pop in. So I will then take a powder highlighter. This one is by Tarte. Um, I believe it's called the Twinkle Palette. And there's three different shades here. And I just switch between the two of them. So I'm gonna go with the shade today, which is Moonlight. And I brought a little travel brush in my cosmetic bag. So I'm just gonna kinda of tap it in the powder. And then I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna apply it everywhere I layered the Glisten Up Skin Stick on. So I'm gonna apply it at the top of my lip. I'm going to apply it at the tip of my nose. I'm also gonna take a little bit and apply it to the bridge of my nose. And then I'm gonna take a little bit and just dust it on, actually kind of tap it on to the high points of my cheeks. And then I'm also going to put a little bit just above my eyebrows. Basically, you're trying to put it on any high point of your face that's going to catch the light. Um, that way it'll make your skin look super dewy and it'll highlight everything you want to highlight. And your contour will kind of slim your face and then the highlight will help it all come together. Now, clearly this is not the finished look. Um, I had to show you guys this step first because then it wants to kind of once you are done with that and you want to blend it all together, I take my blush. This is just a MAC blush um, called Fleeting Romance. And so you're just going to take a little bit of your blush and you're going to blend it all in together. That way it has like a really nice transition between the highlight and your contour. And that's basically it for that. Now, I wanted to make sure I didn't have lipstick on when I showed you this, because I wanted to show you how I do take the highlighter just right above my Cupid's bow. So I'll just apply my lipstick really quick. And one great trick for applying a matte liquid lipstick, which are super on trend right now, this is one um, here that's a little travel size. If you want to use a lip scrub prior to applying this, so go ahead and use um, either Snowden or Orange Caramel Lip Scrub, rub it on your lips, rinse it off, and then apply the rest of your makeup, your liquid lipstick will go on much smoother. So I will just apply this really quickly before we see the finished look. Just apply a little bit.
little bit of this. So if you haven't ever used a liquid lipstick before, also just a side note while I'm already on here, you don't want to apply it like a gloss. It's not something that you apply and rub your lips together. You actually want to paint it on to your lips because it'll dry that way. Now that I have that on, one last trick to kind of bring it all together is if you take a gloss, and I'm going to use the NYX Butter Gloss in Fortune Cookie, and if you apply a little bit of, glo of gloss just to the center of your lip, it'll help give you a little bit more of a pout and kind of tie in all of that shine and glowiness. All right, so that is the finished look. I feel much better. I had waited all day to put this on so I could film this for you guys, so I, now I feel complete. Um, again, it is the Glisten Up Skin Stick. It's $14, and it's actually very comparable to a different product that's at Sephora that I used to use once upon a time before I ever got this prototype, um, and it runs for $28, so, and you get, I think it's 0.36 ounces and this one's 0.5 ounces for $14. Amazing steel. It's going to last you forever. Um, I've been using my last prototype for months now and I still have plenty left. So I am definitely hoarding these favorite products. And yeah, that's it for the makeup tutorial. I hope you guys learned something and I hope you enjoyed watching.